practical alternative to email which could be used for secure electronic transmission of sensitive documents is to install and use a secure portal that requires two-factor authentication for a guest to gain access to where the sensitive documents or information is stored. Two-factor authentication requires a second communication channel by which additional authentication information is sent. The second channel could for example be SMSs or any messaging application on a mobile device. I can use a tool we created to demonstrate the operation of a two-factor authentication secure portal which allows us to provide access to sensitive information. Users are registered by means of a username and a password as well as their telephone number to access the portal. So I enter my username and my password. I then need to click on the capture. In this case, it asks for taxis. I just select the taxis that I see in the pictures and say verify. And now I can go ahead and submit my request for access to the portal. The portal then proceeds to send me a two-factor authentication PIN. In this case, we made use of the Telegram app. It sends me a PIN which is valid for 10 minutes, which I can then use to gain access to the functionality of the portal. Once inside the portal, now I've got access to whatever sensitive information it might be that needs to be shared with me.